three, two, one, zero. All engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. Hi, everybody, and welcome back to Mission Control for another feature focused video. In this video, we're going to discuss DMX settings, stream ACN. The DMX settings window allows you to set how DMX is routed out of the console either through the DMX ports, ArtNet, or streaming ACN. The lines fixtures are patched you may have more than one output as well as more than one protocol being used for output at the same time. If DMX settings are wiped on the start of a new show, the outputs A through H will default to the lines 1 through 8 depending on the outputs of the console and all ArtNet and streaming ACN lines are unassigned. Streaming ACN is a multicast protocol. This in basic terms means a pool is created and whichever nodes want to listen, jump in the pool and will receive the packets for the universes it requires. Streaming ACN can support up to 63,999 universes. However, you can use approximately 200 on a gigabit network before it becomes laggy. Streaming ACN allows you to change priorities for devices, which can be useful in an environment like a festival where front of house desk is an Avalites and the guest desks are different manufacturers. Rather than have to spend time disconnecting the DMX or network cables from one desk to another and then getting the desk to output, you can connect them using streaming ACN as a protocol and change the priority. For example, if the main FOH desk is being used and the guest desk wasn't, the priority for the FOH desk could be set at 200 and for the guest console at 100. Multiple outputs can be assigned per line. So let's see that in action. First, we'll go ahead and click AVO and disk, or if we're using the Titan 1 or Titan Go interface, click the system key and then choose DMX settings from our soft keys. As we see here, I have the default DMX settings, which is going to be outputs A to line 1, B to line 2, C to line 3, D to line 4, so on and so forth, depending on the outputs of my console. And you can see that all streaming ACN and ArtNet are unassigned at this time. To assign streaming ACN, simply click on it, and then go to soft keys. We can set our quantity if we wish. If we want to change our universes from auto, so I've, it, it would start assigning for whatever line is currently shown here, in this case one, or we can set it to be a specific line. We'll go ahead and set our quantity to 10, and then click on line one, and we can now see that we have assigned 10 lines of streaming ACN. If I set my quantity back to one, and assign my universe to say that I need to assign streaming ACN universe 28 to line 1. I simply change my universe to 28 and then click on line 1 and you can see that now anything fixtures I had patched on line 1 would be coming out of output A on the back of the console, streaming ACN universe 1 and streaming ACN universe 28. Clicking the cog next to streaming ACN allows you to adjust these settings. DMX output allows you to temporarily disable the output. Merge priority this we be set between 0 and 200. The streaming ACN specification allows multiple consoles to send out DMX on the network. The priority value tells the receiving node which console to listen to if it gets DMX from more than one. H of higher values, take priority. You would normally use this to connect a backup console with a lower priority setting. Block RDM if enabled. RDM traffic is blocked on this module. Synchronization address. Changes the universe address the synchronization is performed over. Setting this to 0 will disable the sync. Universe Sync lets the output of multiple universes of streaming ACN be synchronized together. This eliminates issues such as image tearing and out of sync strobes within arrays of LEDs across multiple universes. Ethernet XXX sucks whether you want this protocol outputting on this Ethernet adapter. If there are multiple adapters in the system, you can select more than one, and identical information will be sent out on each one. So let's see this here. So if we click the gear icon here on streaming ACN, we can see those settings pop up here. DMX output, again, we can turn it on and off. Merge priority, again, we can set this higher or lower for adjusting which console has control of the rig at this time. This could be a mixed console network between uh, an ABLS console, an MA console, a hog, whatever. Uh, these can also be changed with macros in the show library. Block RDM, so we can turn RDM on or off. Our synchronization address, uh, see here we all the Ethernet and uh, network adapters on this computer. I can turn it to either have it go out just one, go out both, or go out none. To save these settings, simply click the X on the pop-up. We also see we have the gear icon next to each streaming ACN line after it's been assigned. If we click on that, 
Uh, we can change its name if we wish. We can set it to blind mode or live mode or change the universe if we need to. To save our DMX settings after we've set them, simply click exit, and then exit a second time to exit the system menu. That is DMX settings, setting up streaming ACM to use on your Avalites console. Thanks for joining us. Please subscribe. And catch you next time. Thanks. Bye. We'll stop. Roger, we'll stop, Discovery. Welcome back. A great ending to the new beginning.